it. Oh, he's off. <laughs> That's all right. It's what he's made for, isn't it? Good morning, guys. How are we doing? So today, me and my friend Sean here, we're going to swap bikes. Obviously, you already know, I've got the uh, 2020 Cube Stereo Hybrid 160. And surely, boys, got... This is what I'm going to be riding. What year is this? 2020 Specialized Levo. The bottom spec that they did bottom spec but he's going to be modifying it as he goes nice 700 watt battery and and the rear wheel 27.5 on the back lovely bit of kit aluminium v12s lost a few pins already Well, I must admit, Sean, I've always wanted to have a go on a Levo. And I was going to maybe buy a Levo or a Canevo. So this is the point where I'll find out if I've actually made a mistake or not I buying this either. bike. Because <laughs> if I end up liking your bike more, I'll be like, oh, shit. I think I may go for a Canevo next. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. Just because they both have it. It's 27 back and front. Yeah. But then it's a bit longer, so yeah. that's around one a bit of a Hmm. We'll see, we'll see. Right, let's give it a go. Got a sick trail to go down. And yeah, let's send the Levo down and the kib. See what we think. And we'll find we're exchange faults at the bottom, yeah? Winner. Wow. Oh yeah, back brake problems. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Shark brake problems. <laughs> yeah. Well, sitting on it feels sweet already. That's a medium. Medium, yeah, that's large. Oh, is this large? Yeah, that is. Right. What you want to do is go straight now. That's it. Oh, handles well. Oh, the bros motor's got some power already. Oh, the brakes are terrible. <laughs> I can see what you mean about the back brake. Jeez, there's no power. He's bleeding, guys. Oh, he's off. <laughs> That's all right. It's what he's made for, isn't it? I'm liking this. Must admit. Oh. <laughs> yeah, see what I mean? That's why I wanted the Fox suspension. What do you reckon? Really nice and light. And <laughs> Does it feel lighter than yours? Riding it does. Should we go up here and see what it's like? On the... yeah. Well, the book said I should have got a small frame. Yeah. And that's what the book said, but... That feels perfect for me, medium. Yeah, that's much better, the seats in it. Feels like it'd be better for jumping. Yeah, I think it's more like reach when nowadays when they say sizing. It's more kind of uh, how far you've got to go for the handlebars. But see, this, the large, feels fine for me. Yeah. It's weird. Does that feel heavier? Um, I don't know, it feels about the same, maybe lighter. I think it is lighter though, isn't it? This is like 21, 22 kilos. Sure. Whereas that's like 23 something. <laughs> Wheelie in my bike. Turn right here. Let's see what the motor's like. Back in the turbo. Turbo. Love it. Well, good. Nice. <laughs> 
Suspension and brakes, you're right. saying? What do you reckon on the motor? Yes, uh, smooth power delivery. Yeah. Sure. Just feels a lot softer. Yeah. Even the motor. Set up when I got the software upgrade, it did go more smoother and. It is, isn't it? But it seems a bit more like. Yeah, that's how I prefer this though. Yeah. I prefer this bros motor because it's more brutish and the power's more solid straight away. And that's how that used to be before I got the software upgrade. A bit of hit. The brakes, mate. Oh, I need a set of brakes. <laughs> <laughs> well. You can still chill on it if you want, mate. Yeah, we'll have a bit more of a go, can't we? Yeah. Oh, I'm really liking this. It's really nice. Well, I know they're not the best motors. Or most reliable, reliable is the main thing. Yeah. But because the shop is 10 minutes from my house. Right? Yeah, exactly. I'd, for me, it grows all day long. Yeah. I mean, if this went wrong, where would you send the Bosch motor? Do you have to send the bike off? You can take it to Berkshire Cycles and then they got to send it to Germany and yeah. it can take over a month. Well, Cause I've always been lucky with Specialised because he's always had yeah. the motor on the shelf. If, I guess if I went there and they'd all gone, you'd have yeah. to wait. Yeah. But I've just been lucky. Yeah, Chris at Berkshire Cycles has got stuff in stock ready to go, specialised. Yeah, it's amazing. Whereas Bosch, he doesn't. He has to order it. Yeah, so it depends where you, where you live, I guess, for what e bikes really for you. Yeah. I just got used to that now, and I like it. What about the handling on this? Yeah. Um, I don't think it handles as well as yours. I mean, it's the first other bike I've ridden except for mine. <laughs> All right. It's been like nine months now, so. so. It's, it's, yeah, it's nice. Winner. Yeah, your yeah. brakes are horrendous, but they're not they're working. Dangerous. dangerous. Front one's right. Front one's good. It's not bitey though, is it at all? No, it's kind of fadey straight away. Yeah, I'm really liking the Levo. But I don't feel like I've made a mistake, if you know what I mean. No, I, I thought I might have made a mistake and this would be a lot better than that. But actually, I think I would have been happy with both. Saying that, this ride's just like my mate Merida. E-bike. Yeah, it feels like a Merida. Yeah. Handlebars are a lot close, but I guess it's the frame size. Frame size, isn't it? yeah. Should we do a final thoughts? Hey? What are you saying then? What are you saying? It's, it's a nicer bike to ride, but I don't know whether it's just because it's a change. Yeah, it's no the motor's quite noisy. It's, it sounds more mechanical. Yeah. Whereas that one sounds more like electric. It's hard to explain. Yeah, yeah. You can hear bearings in this almost. Could be wrong. <laughs> yeah, it's lovely. Brakes. Absolutely amazing. Yeah. I might steal them. <laughs> um, yeah, no, wicked. Good bike, love it. It's a real nice riding position. I don't know whether it feels better because it's a medium rather than a large. Yeah. But yeah, it's lovely. Suspension's unbelievable. Just, uh, I've got something to look forward to upgrading little parts. Yeah, yeah. Over the next 10 years. <laughs> nice, mate, nice. How about the uh, Levo? Yeah, really like the Levo, Sean. Love it. I like the motor. It feels like my one was before. It was sort of the software upgrade, a bit more brutish and more power all in one go. I think this handles better than mine, like in the corners, it holds the line better. I've got a lot more confidence going around the corners. Yeah. It just, I don't know. There's loads of things to think of, like different tire yeah. brands. Yeah, it could be anything, but it, it just feels like the geometry, it just holds the line better. 
but yeah i don't think i made a mistake by buying that because i was going to buy one of these i like both yeah to be honest i think i'd be happy with both bikes definitely would like the fox suspension on here but apart from that and the brakes maybe i'd be happy with this bike john yeah i'd be happy with a levo i think, I, think right. I really really like it i think it looks nice as well looks good in black hmm. i like the dropper pace that worked lovely the 2022 ones are big change yeah i really like it i quite like the um just the stealth sean's got it on like a ghost mode where it doesn't light up but as soon as you hit the button it does so that's turbo trail eco off and then that's battery life i really like that it's cool isn't it i didn't think i would like it but actually the screen, a little less simple, yeah simple, i was always like oh i want a screen i want to see everything happening i want to yeah. But actually, I like this as well. This is good. I haven't even um, connected it to the app since I got a new phone. No. Seven months ago. <laughs> yeah. The motor went at 360 miles on my old phone. Yeah. And they replaced it, and it's probably done about 1,500 miles now, I reckon. So if this is your second motor, and you've done 1,500 miles on this one, 300 on the last one. Yeah. Nice, mate. It's nice they just swap it out for you, isn't it? Yeah, like I said, if they've got the bits on the shelf, I'm pretty sure if they're, they're willing to be able to do it that day, they'll, they'll do it for you. Yeah. Mine was ready the next morning. Nice. See, I've had that, well, a year and a half, and never had a problem. Mm. Never missed a beat. Yeah, it's just fantastic. It's good. Well, nice. Thanks for lending me your bike. Yeah, Sean. Be, uh, keeping this one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Brilliant. Well, it's been a pleasure, isn't it? Thanks for watching the video, guys. I hope this is some sort of uh, entertainment or help. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. See you later.